ไม่อันจะมีกี่ละกี่ละก็มีอันเราจะกลับมาอีกครั้งดังนั้นพวกเราจะไปท่องเที่ยวในวันนี้ใช่ไหมครับใช่ครับวันนี้ฝนตกหนักมากแล้วฝนตกหนักมากเราจะมีสวนสนุกๆเป็นเวลาเป็นเวลาเป็นเวลาเป็นเวลาเป็นเวลาเป็นเวลาเป็นเวลาเป็นเวลาเป็นเวลาเป็นเวลาเป็นเวลาเป็นเวลาเป็นเวลาเป็นเวลาเป็นเวลาเป็ We're going over to the what do you call it? The bay, one of those bays over there. And uh, oh, <laughs> Kira, <laughs> she's stuck. So we're gonna put up the tent and just relax for a day. It's been a lot of work lately as well, so. ข้าดีอยู่ยันตามีข้าดีอยู่ที่ฮะเอ็ดูไอเอ็ดูไอจีลนั่นแหละเออ so okay ก็มีอะไร No, so what did I say? Yeah, we are going over there, put up the tent and uh, have a good time and some food, relax. I hope uh, we can see an, uh, a sea eagle today. We might do. I did last time I was out here. You never know. I hope I don't see any wild sheep today. There is a a pack of animals wandering around. I hope my sound is uh, good enough. It's blowing real hard now, so but we'll see. Yeah. โอเคอินจอยอ
Oh, I have to have a little rest. Ooh, wee, wee, wee. I might uh, try and get up through the bushes and I will get up at the campsite. I recognize that pine tree up there. Kind of up there. So I, uh, I will try to bushwhack. <laughs> Ska vi göra det Kira? Ska vi gå där? Här Bolis. Kom hit. Yeah, but there are some some kind of a trail I can use. But that's good. And meanwhile, you can enjoy all the beautiful water. Wow! It's been uh, raining lots and lots lately. I see there are some sheep droppings on the trail, so I better be careful with her. Oh, it was steep. No, I don't want her to attack them. Oh. She, she's not evil, she's very kind, but it might be in the nature to to hunt. Oh god. Ooh. Ah. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna stop her, baby. We're gonna stop here. Okay, I'm gonna put up the tent then. So see you later, guys. Okay.
we're all good now. Who? Uh, yeah, I, I'm gonna make me a cup of tea and something to eat now. So see you soon. It's a very nice area. This. This is also pretty close to my house. I uh, more and more often uh, use these campsites near my home. I'm getting too old, you know, <laughs> for a proper wild camp. So uh, we'll do the second best. You get out and get some fresh air. That's good for you. So if you can't do the big, big stuff, then you go for uh, easier solutions and I mean uh, I will show you around this area it's perfectly fine to be out here having some fresh air and have a little walk bring your doggy yeah have some great food and uh, yeah that's super nice so uh, yeah I guess I will uh, uh, cook me now some food and sh after that I will show you the area. Okay? Okay, Kira. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Such a good girl. Yes. Yeah. This is a very beautiful uh, area indeed there are lots of water running these days it's been uh, as i told you it's been raining a lot lately but it, just look how uh, how beautiful this area is it's so beautiful this is oh prime country have a look. Beautiful dog and the beautiful scenery. It can't get any better than this. So guys, if you can go out and do some wild camping, just have fun out in the nature. It is good for you. So come and say Yeah, it is just awesome being around here. And then this little river will uh, run down to the sea. Okay. Let's go check out the ruins. Come on, girl. Come. There's sun, sun. Oh my. It's a crow. Yeah, there's been there's been a, a settlement here, maybe hundred years ago, something like that. Maybe hundred and fifty years old. So um, just uh, wait a minute. See what we say. Okay. Challenge that this is both in English and German. So if you are interested, you can just stop the video and read. Uh, it's from. There has been habitation here for over a thousand years. Okay. 
but these ruins uh, maybe the first written records on farming they're from 1603 so that's a long time There are uh, several ruins in this area, so I guess I'm not sure if this was a, a barn house or a, a house for people, I'm not sure. It's pre pretty strange uh, thinking about people been living here for over a thousand years. Okay. There are more ruins further on. You might say they are maybe a little bit more exciting. See them birds playing in the wind. I don't know if you can see them. Maybe I can punch on punch in on the video. It's a little bit sad that I have to tie Kira down. But uh, I won't get in any tr kind of trouble with the, the farmers. Sorry for the weird colors inside the tent. So, let me say, Ar. Let me go for hotel. Oh. Yes, 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 yes. Let's go with that. I want to get me a quick meal. Knur. Big pasta snack pot, tomato and mozzarella. Okay. I can boil me a cup of tea as well. And Kira is going to get some uh, boxy jammy jammy stuff. Max dog. With beef.
There you go, baby. Always remember to feed your dog first. He's your best friend. And he's loyal. He will never disappoint you. Is this good content? Give me a thumbs up then. Yeah. I know you will. Oh, it's such a good feeling when the tent is up and uh, water is boiling. It's so peaceful and you can hear the wind blowing. This is medicine, man. I'm telling you. Good medicine. Let me check on the water. It's not ready yet. Can I pump up the volume? Like so. Yeah. It's getting there. I know, I know, I know. I should get a tripod. I will bring one on my next trip. I promise. And my cup for a cup of tea. Yeah, I guess it's enough. It's boiling now. Yeah. It's enough. I got my spoon. I can stir it up a little bit. I don't know, I have to wait a couple of minutes. Meanwhile, I can make a cup of tea. I really enjoy these ones. Puka, original chai. This is chai tea with spices and milk powder and some sweeteners. Ah, really good. Get it up. Get it in there. And maybe Three of those. Maybe I can. Ready. Yeah, it thickens up. Yeah, it's good. Tomato flavored. Some mozzarella cheese. 
and some spices. Mmm, this is very nice, very nice. Mmm, awesome. What about you, Kira? You fancy another serving? Ah. There you go, baby. Spilling out my tea. amazes me every time. This tea is just lovely. So, how are you guys? Are you all good? Everybody? Safe? Hope so. Mm. So my plan is to stay for tomorrow and then take another route back home. Um, yeah, I think uh, I will have a different route back home. So I will uh, upload this little video tomorrow I guess so yeah um, as I said I hope everybody is well doing good so um, yeah I guess I will uh, I see my battery I've changed oh, Two batteries already. Can't understand. It goes through batteries like hot knife and butter. Uh, let me see. Now we have uh, only 50 50% 50 left. Okay. So um, I don't know. I hope I can film some more, but. If I just suddenly stop, it's my batteries. Sorry about that. Never learn. I need more batteries. More batteries. Alrighty, see you soon. So, Donny, uh, your son got the uh, same type of dog, the Alaska Husky, didn't he? And she was named Kira as well. <laughs> That's a coincidence. Uh, nice dogs. I'm very fit. I can uh, use my bike and go on trips with her, and run with her. But I, I, I can't uh, run with her. She kills me <laughs> if I try something like that. But I usually I use my my bike, and then she's uh, tied up and safe. I don't know why, but many people uh, are a little bit skeptic to these uh, huskies. But they are. 
just ordinary dogs and they were very nice, very calm, you see. She, she looks a little bit skittish and afraid. Uh, she's always been like that a little bit, like she's worried, but I don't think she really is. Uh, I just think uh, <laughs> she looks like this. <laughs> Yeah, such a good girl. Oh yes. Oh yes. I didn't bring Varg today. It's too much with uh, two of these dogs. More than enough with one. If I'm up high in the mountains, okay. I can be more free. But uh, this, this park area is uh, only half an hour from people and there are some livestock wandering around here. They're wild sheep but um, there's somebody who owns them too so I won't take any chance bringing two. It's too much for me alone and if, if something happens and yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a good girl. Oh yes. Want to say hi to Doogie? Hello Doogie. My Scottish mate. Hello. I'm Kira. Best dog in Norway. Yes you are. Still hungry girl? You've had 800 grams, girl, behave. Mm. So I flew my drone earlier and uh, it's almost, I guess it's too windy, it's a 249 gram drone, so um, it's very handy to, to bring such a small drone but uh, in Norway it blows always blowing, always wind. You might, uh, yeah, you might bring your drone and you can't even fly with it because it's too windy. So that's a bummer, but it's um, easier to, um, well, um, I have re registered it and I have some insurance on it. So everything is legal, but if you have a bigger one, you have to do more stuff to be allowed to to drive it. Mm. But it's fun, fun to to have a drone. Yeah, I've got some signals here so mm -hmm. so what about you guys do you uh, have a drone if so please tell me I'm curious yeah what kind of drones maybe a Mavic
I guess I'm going to run out of battery soon, but uh, yeah, I can uh, go for a small walk and show you where we are going tomorrow. So you can see my second route for, to this place. It's more like uh, uh, after you go through the woods, the small forest here, and uh, you follow the stream, you can, uh, after a, a while, you will meet up the public path, gravel path, and you can follow that back to where we have parked our car. So. So that's, that's okay. Yeah. So I guess I, I will show you our route back home tomorrow. I've noticed they have uh, put up a new wood br bridge over there as well. So that's cool. That's cool. So, um, not just so you can have a little taste of the area, how it looks like and stuff. It's always such a, oh, it's so beautiful to see the running water. You agree, Kira? Yes, you agree? Last time uh, we had to cross the river by foot, but it wasn't so much water then. Uh, okay, something's happening here. I put up markers. Maybe I'm gonna fix up this place. That's positive. Come here. I miss Bella, my uh, other dog. She was so calm and you could just uh, let her walk alone. She was just uh, following me everywhere. I dare not do this with Kira. She is just as beautiful, but uh, they are different personalities, like we humans. So, I have to tire. her. I don't like to, but I have to. We have uh, a recently new law I say recently I, I guess maybe some few years ago they decided that um, the dog can't be loose all year round so that's a little bit too much So this is a wooded area. I love uh, woods, the trees and all this stuff. It's so protected and it's so calm. So if you if you bring a hammock, you can stay inside uh, these small woods and be completely safe. Okay, girl, go on. Come on. It's 
So now I have 20% left of my battery. So I guess I need to either bring a power bank or more batteries. I have uh, put my files on 5.3k and 25 pictures per uh, second so maybe that's why it eats through my batteries so this is uh, the route we will take tomorrow I just wanted to show you how it looks around here you, you can see this is in, in my eyes this is pure beauty you can't get any better than this it is so beautiful I love them trees it's good to be up on the up, up on a mountain but I don't know I just love being in the woodlands what what do you guys like the most the mountain top or a woodland let me know as I said I'm curious so this is the gate So we will be walking back there tomorrow. Maybe half an hour. It's not more than that. So okay you guys, we are going back to the camp. So from uh, me and uh, Kira, thank you so much for joining us. So I hope I see you soon. And as always, stay safe. Okay, bye-bye.